All right, this is the Onshape interface. So Onshape here, you can always get back to Onshape and it gets me kind of back to my Onshape. Over here, I got a couple documents. I'm just gonna trash those. I'm not gonna use those. Trash that one. And this is what you're gonna see. First thing we're gonna do is go create and hit a folder and we're gonna call it cat. 20 slash 21, just like we did before. And there's our folder. And now we're in my on shape. I'm in my cloud storage of CAD 2021. Now we're going to create a document in there. And we're going to call this Dogbone Project. A little bit of deja vu here, but we're going to get this figured out. So it's a lot the same as Fusion 360 is. Um, it's just a matter of figuring out where the parts are, but like this is extrude, we have the, all of our different setups, and we're good to go, and we're gonna take you through exactly what we looked at. First thing is create sketch. One little difference well, is this little sketch plane pops up. It's going to ask me which sketch pane, plane to put it on, and I'm going to put it on top. This is like that green check mark over there. It's just kind of in our way a little bit, but it's okay. So I went to top, and then also, it, this doesn't automatically go normal to the plane or, or look at the plane straight down. So we're going to click on top. Now comes our process. We remember this. From over here, from our CAD project, we have to do, and we're going to do this a little bit different this time. We're going to do the rectangle first. That's 1.35 by 3. So this is just changing a little bit of the, the things. So I click down here, comes into here, 1.35 for my dimension there, hit tab. Sorry, I'm having a little bit of problems right there. So let's start that again. Place that. One point three five. Hit enter and then type three and hit enter. So now we have that placed and we're ready to go draw in our circles. Our circles, if we remember, our radius of 0.75. Then I'm going to come over here, click center, diameter is 1.5, click it, 1.5, enter. One point five and one point five. Okay, now if you remember, we come into trim. Look at that; it looks pretty much the same. It's just a pair of scissors there. I'm going to come in, clicking on my edges I don't want, and you'll see it gets rid of some dimensions as I do this. And that's perfectly fine. But that's the dog bone base shape there. So again, starting with the rectangle, 1.35, and working our way from there. If I want to, I can put these dimensions back on. And you'll notice it comes up with a dimension tool now. 
click those two. That was already on there. Center. I lost my three over here. And we'll hit finish sketch. Go to my home view. And I can see it laying flat. And then we'll be moving on to the next step.